Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Nichelle and today we are going to be planning for the month of July in my A5 inserts and um, the kit that I'm going to be using it is from Soda Pop Studio. So her, she has a two page kit and then a notes page. So here is the um, two page kit and then I started cutting it and you'll see why. And then here is the second page with the additional boxes and bill dues paydays, some icons. I've already taken the liberty of adding the date dots because this is undated and I needed to know where I was putting things. And then here is the notes page, which I'm most excited about. This is made for an Erin Condren, but I'm going to make it work in my A5. I love these little circles here. This one says monthly goal, highlight, word of the month, favorite, and then you have a notes cover page and then a bottom one, you have some arrows. And then the second page, you have all kinds of goodies. All these dates, arrows, school, planning, wish lists, fitness, movies, bills, this month, gratitude. And then you have some more headers and then you have some flags. And then you have hearts, stars, and birthday, all kinds of goodness. Okay, so, I totally forgot that my monthly starts with Monday and most kits start with Sunday. So yeah, um, I am trying to decide on whether or not I want to try and lay these down accordingly, which is, it's not, I don't think it's really going to work really well. So what I'm, probably going to do is I'm just not even going to use their headers and just use mine to just make it much easier and much nicer. I did cut my flag a little bit. I'm kind of upset about that. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Now, if, if this is your first time, I have a month on four pages. So when you um, look at it here, you have the notes page and then you have the um, the little checklist then you have your month and then it starts again okay so first we are going to go ahead and get started with the um, the month the monthly spread and I'm just going to move that to the side just a little bit and I know that her headers are too long for mine so I think what I'm going to do is just um, move this all the way I'm just gonna butt it up against the um, the lines here and, I, and not worry about trying to cover up the Monday and all that good stuff and I think someone's vacuuming so I apologize Okay, so let me cut that. I know we're already in the second week of July and it's just been really busy. Really, really, really busy. And let's go ahead and put the second half down. And... I'm probably going to have to cut the holes to where it punch the holes. Ah, uh, it's not laying down right. See, I want it even. Oh, please don't stick. Okay. Woo! Oh no! Great. Seriously? I'm just saying. Ah! Uh. Okay. 
goodness gracious. Okay. All right, so I am going to, let me see, and then you have these right here, which they are um, already um, uh, too big. So let me get out my scissors, my cutter again, and I'm going to have to take some off. And let me see if I can, because I was trying to play with it earlier. So I was trying to get an idea of where I need to cut it. And where are my scissors? I mean, not scissors, but. Mm, this is gonna be interesting. Okay. Mm. All right, I may have to Okay, I didn't figure this out really well. So let me figure this out and see what I want to do. And I will be right back. All right, so I think I figured it out. I think what I'm going to do, because it's too much trying to figure out how to cut these boxes. So I think I'm just going to add some washi going across and then use these boxes here to kind of make flags on each end of the page. So let's go ahead and do that. I pulled out these two washies from, they are from Michaels. Um, I don't know if they were individual or in a, to in a tube, um, but I think they match pretty darn close to this kit. And I am thinking that I want to maybe do the pink up here. Do, I think I'm going to do the pink at the top and then this color at the bottom. Um, I think what I'm going to do is, let me put down, sorry about that noise. I think I'm going to take one of these strips and lay that across here and then do my washi down the side like I typically do. And I think I want, <sighs> let me see kind of which one we see which one looks better. I think this is going to clash with that. This may kind of bring it out as well as this one. All right, I am going to go with this one here. And if it overlaps, that's okay. Oh, you know what? Let me put down my washi first and then I can go back and add that. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. And honestly, I think I love it more because it's not exactly like everybody else's. 
So, okay, I'm definitely going to add a piece down there. And I think I'm going to go to kind of go with that. I'm going to use this strip down here. But I don't want, honestly, I think I'm going to leave it because I want those flags to show. So forget what I said about that. And let's go ahead and get into planning. So first thing I want to do is go ahead and mark my, um, it's not a vacation, to be honest. Um, I have my national conference. So that's where I will be. I leave on the 26th and I return Monday. So I want to go ahead and mark that first so I won't forget. I won't forget anyway, but still. And let me grab my scissors. Okay, and then let me put that here. Make sure you guys are still in frame, okay. All right, I need just a little bit more strip. And I think I will use one of those strips from that I cut. Okay, so the one thing I noticed about Miss Little uh, about Miss Little Paper, I'm sorry, about Soda Pop Studio, she doesn't have a huge variety of icons. So typically this wouldn't bother me if I wasn't going anywhere like flying, but because I am, I do want to mark it because I never get a chance to mark it. So I pulled out a some of my leftover icons from my other my other kits. And this one was from, I think, Planting Roses. And the green kind of sort of matches into this green right here. So I wanted two of the same color and the same size. Um, let me see. How do you... I have to turn the other one the other way. Because I'm coming. I'm leaving here. And then I will be returning on the 31st. And I am going to use, I think, this flag here. You know what? I'm not even going to use this flag. I may save it for something else. I'm just going to use a, since it's like one day by itself, I am going to use, um, I'm going to use one of these. Okay, and just put this at the bottom. Okay, and then here I'm going to overlap just a little bit with over that. Okay, perfect. Okay, so National Conference is out of the way. And now we can go ahead and start um, planning. So the only holiday that we had was Independence Day. And of course, their boxes are wider than mine. So I'm going to cut this in half. And layer it. Ooh, I was about to put it on the wrong day. I didn't do anything else that day anyway, so it's okay. Okay. 
Perfect. All right, so there we go on that. Um, I'm not going to worry about any previous like wacky holidays. I'm not going to worry about that. Um, I do want to mark my bills though. So and a lot of them are my subscriptions to be totally honest, but I do want to um, continue to mark them. So let's see. She has one, two, three, four, five bills. I may do something else instead of that um, because I don't have a whole lot of space. And she has all these stars and flags and all that good stuff. So, um, do, 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 do. let's see, what do I want to do? Um, all right, I'll just start putting them down, and if I, I'll do every other one. How about that? Okay, so on the second, my Panda Box subscription, and I'm going to have to cut these because they're too long, of course. Okay. And I do want to mark them as I go. And where is my pen? Okay, the pen I'm going to be using is from the Panda Box subscription. Love this diamond pen. I love these. I also have one from um, Simply Gilded when she came to the Houston Planner Bash. Love, love, love. Okay. Okay, so there's the panda box. And then there's nothing on, okay, on the third, my daughter had a driving lesson. So I do want to keep track of that. And let me see if she has any cars. Okay, she does have one car. So I will mark that one. And then she also has one on the uh, this coming up Monday. So... Okay. All right. And then I didn't have anything on the 5th. The 6th was our fall premiere and I have a bill. I do want to mark, mark that we had that fall premiere. So I'm going to mark that with a pink one. And let me go ahead and cut this. Oh, let me cut it before I lay it down. And hopefully I don't cut it too. Of course, of course it's not straight. Like seriously. So they gave us a sneak peek of the fall products for fall and I'm going to mark that with some balloons okay that was on Thursday and then today's the seventh no today's not the seventh I'm sorry and then the eighth I had my ice cream social so I definitely wanted to mark that one and I'm going to use a different color and pray I cut this one straight as well like seriously like why I can't cut a straight line no this was Saturday and I think I have my now I just got to find them, but I think I have my ice cream stickers. Oh, I do. I just got to find them. Okay. I need to mark that, but I want to mark down that I did have my ice cream social yesterday. Okay. And then today's the ninth. 
and there are not any bills coming out and then tomorrow is Monday and that is payday so I want to mark that and I'm going to go with the darker pink okay all right and then tomorrow and then Tuesday it is slurpy day so I'm going to go and take the boys and get a slushy or slurpy whatever you want to call it and I am going to use one of these stars to mark that that's the 11th right yes okay All right, and then nothing on the 12th. The 13th, I have a webinar training, and it's National French Fry Day. So we're going to have to go get some French fries on the 13th, and I'm just going to go along with these stars. I need to go get my, let me go grab my um, tweezers, and I'll be right back. All right, I am back. I found my tweezers and we were um, getting ready to put down for the 13th. Let me go back to my calendar. Someone just put, booked a party, so I had to put her on my calendar so I won't forget. Okay, so the 13th is National French Friday and also we were gonna be going to the water park. So let me mark that and since that is pink, let me zoom you guys in a little bit. Since that is pink, I definitely don't want to put a pink star. So I'm going to go with the gold. Okay. I think I'm just, yeah, I'll put it up here. Okay, and that is French Friday. My grandsons, when I told them, they were so excited. And then also, we are going to the water park, so I want to mark that one. And we're going to go floral. Yeah, these things are way too small. Okay, and then um, I don't have anything on the 14th, and then on the 15th I have a um, subscription box coming out, so I wanted to mark that. Oh, I have another bill due on here that was there. I got to put that as well because I was okay. Let me do that real quick. Let me go back and put this bill due in. And let's see. Much straighter, much straighter. Two points for me. All right, I'm gonna have to lift up this balloon a little bit. Okay. I'm just going to put Social Elite. Again, it's another subscription for my business. So I forgot what day that was. So, all right. So now we can go into um, the 14th. I didn't have anything. And then on the 15th, I have a, a 31 subscription coming out that I pay for monthly. And I want to mark that. And I need to fix that while I'm at it because I don't want, I don't need two of them anymore. So, okay. Okay. And then, uh, oh, oh, you know what? Okay. And then on the 16th, it is, um, 
ice national ice cream day i really need to find my ice creams i think i know where they're at hold on a second let me look in here real quick yes i found them i knew i had them okay all right, I'll just leave it in my lap. Okay, these were from Michael's in one of those little bins that they have. And so I wanted to get some of these. So when we go get ice cream and things like that, we can mark that. Okay, so on my on the 8th, I had my ice cream social yesterday. So I wanted to mark that. And I'm just going to cover up this little thing right there. And then on the 16th, it is National Ice Cream Day, so I do want to mark that with an ice cream instead of the little asterisks. And how about I use, instead I'm not using all these big ones here, how about I use an ice cream sandwich? Okay. Okay, there we go. And you guys were out of focus. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Okay. So, I have my Little Miss Paper Re box come out on the 21st. So, let me mark that. And where's my pen? All right, and then on the 23rd, it is National Hot Dog Day. And I could have sworn in that batch for these little samples. Okay, I do have a hot dog, and it doesn't match at all. Okay, but I'm still going to use it. So the 23rd is, which is Sunday, next Sunday, it is the, well, two weeks, National Hot Dog Day. So we are going to mark that. Okay. And then on the 24th, it is National Cousins Day, so be sure and say hello to one of your cousins. And we are going to use this blue one. We haven't had a lot of blue. Um, I'll put it up here. And I'll just write Cousin Day. And then... The 26th, I leave for conference. Okay. And then on the, also on the 26th, I have my um, Scent Share subscription comes out. So let me mark that. Okay, and then I forgot, I got to go back and do something, but on the 27th, I have a Pinterest training. I won't be here for it, but I do want to go back. I just want to have it on my calendar because I want to go back and um, look at the training. So I'm trying to um, do better with that for my business. So I definitely don't want to miss that. I'm going to, like I said, I'll have to come go back and listen to it. Or watch it when I get back from conference which is on the 
27th. Okay, and then the 13th, I have a webinar training. I'm going to miss that because we're going to be going to the water park. Unless she has it in the morning, then I can watch it. If not, then I will miss it. Um, I think I'm going to do it blue. Sorry about that noise. Okay, and then on the 29th, it is National Lipstick Day. So I definitely need to make sure I pre-post that while I'm gone, because I, again, I won't be here. So I do want to Okay. All right. So I believe I have everything down. Um, I think so. I think I actually have a Facebook party coming in this week. Yeah, I have a Facebook party on Thursday. So I do need to mark that. And I will use this one here. It's going to overlap it a little bit because I didn't, I wasn't expecting it. And this is um, Jamie at 7.30. We'll be well home by then, so for that. Okay, so I'm kind of looking over everything and I think I'm done. I think all of this, we kind of zoom out a little bit. All right. Okay, I am loving this thus far. It is looking really, really good. And... Okay, so now let's go ahead and move on to the notes page. This side here, I typically really don't do anything with. I may add some washi to it. Um, so we're primarily going to focus on this and I have so much to work with Okay, so I do know that I want to put down the notes at the top And Oh, you know what? How am I gonna do this? Oh, okay. I think I'm gonna have to do it this way because I want the notes to show of course and it's crooked but I'm not going to stress about it okay so now I want to use these right here. They are really, really nice. And I've changed the way I do my monthly in my A5 because I don't really need my business stuff in here and in my business planner. Um, so this is more kind of like for me. So I'm gonna do the, put all these on here. I think though, because they're, all of them are not going to fit. So I don't want them looking like really tacky. So I'm just gonna kind of like put them in the middle and yeah, I'm going to put them in the middle. Okay, and I definitely need to make sure I fill this stuff out. I've, I am really bad about that, so I definitely want to do better. And I don't want the two pinks by themselves, you know, together. Can I zoom you guys in a little bit more? OK. 
Okay. And this one says word of the month. All right, so now I need to figure out what I want to do. Okay, um, I don't need a work. I don't need happy mail. Um, there are some movies I think that I want to see. There is, let's see, let me kind of think figure out what I want to do. Um, I think my favorite and highlight I can use for gratitude, so I'm not going to use that. I don't need my this month, I'm going to move over there. And then, hmm. Definitely I'll use in the home because there are some things that I really want to get done. Okay. And then I think I'm going to use these arrows. And I'm not going to like give myself, because we're already halfway through the month, so I'm not going to give myself like a whole lot of tasks. I think I'm going to start out with maybe two, because that's being realistic. And then, um, maybe I can do movies, because I think there are some things that I want to go see in the movies. So I think what I'm going to do is maybe do this down here. And then what else in the home? I want to use a couple more. Um, I guess I can do my events so I have an overview. And I know of how many. I have national conference. I had my ice cream social. I had the fall premiere. So I need at least three. And then I may have to just move this one up just a little bit because I have three. Okay, and then there are some movies that I want to go see, so therefore I'm going to just use these hearts. I'm just going to put down two. Too bad they didn't have like um, books. Um, I guess I can use a next month. And I'll just put it right underneath that one. Because I can always do on the side, come on the side of here if I need to to give me more space. So I'm not worried about that. And I have like all of these different things. So I'll just put like three down. Okay, hold on one second. 
Okay, um, I think that I am done. Um, I was thinking about putting something right there, but... I just really don't need anything else to be honest um, I mean maybe next time I'll put my bills um, but I think I think I'm good with this and if I decide later on then I will add it so on this page here I am going to use the um, the planning heading and I'm just going to put this like right smack in the middle. I'm going to do that. And then there's this big flag. I think they have it in the Erin Condra now. Here, I'm just going to add that right to the side up here. And I love all these little arrows and stuff like that. Um, maybe next time I'll use that, but I don't need it right now. Um, maybe next, maybe here. I already have some things down that should have been like a top priority. So maybe if I can slide this in. I mean, I can always white it out if I need to, but I kind of go like this. All right, I think I'm just going to, just because I have it, I think I'm just going to add this here and I'll know next time. I'll just wait when I do August not to, you know, kind of like write them down, but not write them down in here. So that way I can put this down before I do that, if that makes sense. Okay, all right, so I'm going to add just a little bit of washi down here because I don't really fill all this up. However, I do have a lot going on for um, July. I just haven't really filled it all out like I should. So I'm just going to cut this. Just to kind of balance it out. And then I'm going to add this here. And of course, I'm going to make it a flag. I don't know what it is about the flags. I just think it just does so much more to the page. Okay, so I do have to say that I do like this um, layout a whole lot better versus the other way. So I'll be definitely looking for more notes pages like the setup like this versus with the boxes. So I do like this a lot. Um, I was real excited to get this from Soda Pop Studio. Um, so I just need to find something that kind of matches again. So here again, so when you open it up, let me get out my um, planner. That way you can see it better. And I'm going to have to zoom you out as much as I can. And you may see part of my mess. Okay. Oh, let me get that piece right there that let me get these pieces real quick and then this one here okay 
right. All right. So let's go ahead and lay this in. All right, so this is the way, this is what it looks like when it is opened. So you have your notes section, you have your, your, your to-dos for the month, and then you have your uh, month on two pages. And this looks really, really good. I am loving this, and I um, for sure will be taking advantage of the note pages in the future. And I'm definitely going to be um, filling this out and my highlight of the month. And it's probably going to be national conference, to be totally honest. And then word of the month and um, favorites. Um, definitely filling this out, events and all that stuff. So I still have more to do here. But this is what it looks like. And let me just show you what I have left. Again, I have a lot left over. So I do save these different things in case I need to fill stuff in. Or if a kit doesn't come with something and I, that, that I need and it's um, pretty basic to where I can add it in. It doesn't look crazy. Then I'll use that. So um, here was from the notes page that she had. I still have a ton of stuff left over. Just a ton of stuff. And then here's pieces left over from her two page um, monthly kit, which I'll be cutting all this stuff up and you know making it prettier to put into my planner. So thank you guys so much. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it and giving you guys some ideas if you have a planner um, or inserts that are not quite um, fit for an Erin Condren. This, hopefully this will give you an idea on how I um, utilized it. So again, thank you so much for joining me and I will see you in my next video. Bye!